What's up, everybody? It's, uh, oh, what is today? Tuesday, <coughs> November 21st. I'm working on a carrier, Infinity. It's one of the older ones. Uh, here's the model number, serial number. We are giving off, um, a code 71 thermal stage cutout and an 81 low stage thermal cutout for four hours. So let me turn the power off. Um, a lot of times on these, when you see those low stage, high stage cutouts, um, a lot of times it's one of your capacitors. Or with this particular model, um, it happens where the start capacitor doesn't come out of the um, doesn't come out of the circuit, and we'll trip this off. But we'll see what happens. Let me dig in here with the meter and see what's going on. actually just both of these were actually just changed um, on the PM that they had so but I guess that doesn't mean anything Let me uh, let me dig in. Um, let me start uh, tracing some of these things out. Put power back on, um, and then I'll get right back with you, and uh, I'll let you know what I found and uh, explain what I did. All right. See you guys in a minute. All right, guys. I'm back. So this one, capacitors check out. Compressor and fan. Obviously, the fan is on. Compressor is not. Um, Star cap is good. The start relay is good. It is coming out of the circuit when it's supposed to. Both the contactors check out good. They're not um, they're not burnt or pitted. Uh, contactors ohming out about 15 ohms uh, between 15 and 16. So that's good. Um, let me see if I can show you guys. Uh, um, Balancing pressures aren't, you know, it's not bad. So I'm gonna try something here. It's a little bit older. I need to double check and just make sure it is 410. So, 
let's see, let's see, let's see. opinion I think we're either going to have a board issue or a compressor issue just from things I've seen in the in the past because a couple of times when I've sat here um, the low pressure switch is um, is closed I mean it has it has continuity through it but it was given off the low pressure code um, I mean, as you can see, I mean, standing pressures aren't, I mean, they're not great, but it's, it's not low enough to kick it off on low pressure. And now it's to the point where the compressor's not even starting up. It won't even, won't even do anything. So, either that or she kicked off on thermal overload. talking about this in the hangout the other day. I think this might be one of the old Bristols. Yes, 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 yes. I think it might be one of the old Bristols. If that's the case, then this doesn't surprise me. Uh, take it off. One like this, when you have this stage, a lot of guys, you know, you think you're going to check your two wires from the contactor, and you go to the uh, the dual cap, or you know, in this uh, just a single capacitor. But um, here is our uh, our other leg right here. All this does is come to this this top one, and then jumps up <coughs> to the capacitor. So let's see what we got going on here, people. Like I said, bear with me on the uh, camera angles. I actually have the head mount, but this has got a perfect little bench right behind me, so I figured this would be a better view. Uh, you guys, let me know. I'm, I'm learning all these, uh, had all this camera stuff. But uh, I'm loving this GoPro though. It's awesome.
the breaker, so I don't doubt that it's grounded. is good. I'm going to be leaning more towards the board issue. Everybody's having a good day. Figure we got today and then one more day before turkey day. Can't wait. Spend some time with the family. Stuff my face. It's gonna be great. Me and me and Matt Mitchell were talking on the phone. And I'll take some time off for Thanksgiving. I think I might not even uh, might not even work tomorrow and then take Friday off as well. I get a good amount of vacation time, but can't really ever use it. So <laughs> not all in one shot and taking off in the summertime, as we know, is a no-no in the HVAC industry. We have to watch everybody else go on their fancy vacations while we slave away in the, in the summer heat. Huh. God, we have it so rough. So rough. Why do we ever do this trade? Oh. All right, guys. Let me make a call. I'm gonna call and verify. I want to see if this is under warranty or not. Um, I think it is. I think when this was sold, it was um, uh, ten years parts, ten years labor, and it's from 2009. So we we should be good. But let me. Um, let me call, make a call real fast, double check the warranty, and I'll be right back with you guys. Alright, see ya. Alright guys, I'm back. <coughs> um, it is under warranty, uh, parts and labor. So, what I found was, this relay is act was actually sticking. Um, it's not, it wasn't sticking, I guess when I checked it, it, it unstuck. But, what caused this to stick is the board. The board is sending... Um, sending output power when it's not and it's not supposed to be sending um, power out so that's thinking that's the cause of this thing sticking so uh, we're gonna have to replace this board um, and I'm gonna get the star components as well um, definitely gonna replace this this actually checks out good but um, I'm gonna get them both I mean being under warranty just in case um, this is a really good customer of ours and they just had a uh, ECM motor fail um, a couple of months back. Or, no, actually not a couple of months, like maybe a month ago. So I want to make sure these people have heat. Um, I'm going to try to see if um, I can pick up the board. Uh, hey guys, just a brief uh, description on this. I ended up going back the day before Thanksgiving with a new board and the star components. Um, all it needed was the board and the new star capacitor, um, and she was up and running. Um, the board took out the, um, the relay. So that customer is back up and running. Sorry I didn't get any footage for you. Um, but just wanted to let you guys know a summary of what happened. Uh, change the control board change the start relay uh, unit is back up and running it was all under parts and labor warranty no cost to the customer so everything was all good have a good day thanks for watching um, go ahead and if you haven't already subscribe to the channel give me a like uh, give me a share and uh, I'll see you on the next video adios amigos